What's going on YouTube? It's your guy Kent Hollywood Matzinger. We are back at it. It is a early morning. We are here at Walmart. Uh, kind of saw something on Brickseat, saw something on uh, Walmart.com and uh, hopefully it'll be on the shelf as we go through the door right away this morning. Who knows? Uh, only one way to find out. We're gonna head inside but this is going to be a hunt video. We'll see what this Walmart has today and uh, see where we head to next. If you haven't already, jump into the Ken Pool Live. We're having a lot of fun here on YouTube. Also over on Instagram, at Ken Pool Live. But let's get the hunt started. Walmart, let's go. So we are in the collector's area. We are looking for those Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles uh, pinball little sets from NECA. Uh, so far, empty. <laughs> so we'll keep looking around. Got a little beat up Deathstroke there. Got some Doc Brown, Evil Dead, Gundams, a little bit of best action stuff mixed in found some office it a lot of q figs got fig pins little picard versus uh hannibal lecter who wins let's see got some marvel lucha got the macho man randy savage 10 inch pops there. Got some different uh, racing pops, Mario Andretti. Little Avengers. Uh, yeah, He-Man kind of turned around there. Let's look around this side, what we got? A lot of our front lines still. All right, little He-Man. Not too much going on. Lots of pops as usual at this location. Little pop protectors. All right, let's check out the end cap. What do we got here on the end cap? More prime. Uh, a little bit of elf stuff. Superman, so definitely a lot of different things. Got our arcades there. Uh, as we come around, got some 10 inch pops. And we got a couple plushies there at the bottom AC, DC, little Hasselhoff. And we got uh, our Battle of the Bands. So we'll look around and uh, see if we can find these uh, pinball sets. All right, no luck with uh, the pinball pack, so I thought I'd come over and check out the main toy aisle. Uh, we got dinos, dinosaurs, Breck, Jurassic World, uh, all kinds of office stuff. <laughs> nice. Minions, that's kind of like the office. Got our mini G.I. Joe packs. Uh, if you watch the uh, Hascon Fan Fest, let me know what you think of the G.I. Joe movie figures and the classified little snake eyes for you. Uh, a couple Zords there. Godzilla versus Kong. Got uh, Stay Puff Marshmallow Man. Slimer there. Uh, yeah, look at these guys. Cap. And Iron Man. Mech strike. Look out. Get your mech strike. Because I don't see any Marvel Legends except for this guy. It's Frogman. We'll put Frogman up there. Versus. Look at all those empty pegs. Fill them up with figures. Come on. Got a little Spider Man play set there. Flex and bend. 
some DC mini figures, but uh, not really seeing any of those. Uh, McFarlane, got some Star Wars, but uh, not much in the world of Star Wars. We got some red though. All right, red, it is uh, Cheetor, which is that's pretty cool. Walmart uh, coming through with Transformers for us. What else we got here? Yeah, we saw that one. Beast Wars, so a lot of Cheetah. There's Soundwave. So pretty cool. Some red. We got Headmasters all set up there for us. Little Kingdom. So not bad. Star Wars. Halo. A little Fortnite there. Ah, oh, check this out. That is pretty cool. Look at all these Transformers. A little Megatron, Beast Mode, Ultra Magnus. That's pretty cool. Got them standing up right. Little bit of Masters of the Universe for you. Battle Cat there. Raw. Fan. and uh wrestling pretty basic this morning all right i'm gonna take one more look for those uh pinball ninja turtles and that's probably gonna do it for this walmart all right so no pickups at uh walmart uh yeah i'm sure Pinball, NECA is probably there somewhere, but uh, of course, nobody uh, really working in electronics. Uh, Walmart, uh, exclusives, right? Exclusives. Just, uh, just have to go to Walmart, hope that it's out on the shelf, because that is as lucky as you're gonna get when it comes to Walmart. So we'll see. Uh, Maybe I'll call back later, but I doubt anybody will pick up. Um, probably just chilling, waiting for somebody to put them on the shelves so we can uh, find them. The uh, the little NECA pinball set, you get uh, that metallic uh, shredder from the animated series and uh, some other cool stuff, pizza magnets. Who wouldn't want pizza magnets but uh yeah we're going to head back to the toy room and uh i'll show you how about some new gi joe classified figures do you want to see flint you want to see lady jane we'll uh we'll go check those up and uh maybe maybe a new marvel light uh marvel light box got an awesome deal on it so Let's get back to the toy room and I'll show you what's going on. Welcome back to the toy room. We have our G.I. Joe classified series figures, Lady J and Flint. We also have our Marvel official logo light box. So uh, the G.I. Joes I was able to pick up at a local comic shop. Good old Sailfish Comics in uh, Concord Mills area. And then uh, the Marvel Lightbox logo. I'll have all the information in the description. Uh, nice little online store. And uh, was able to scoop that up for $50, which is an awesome deal on those light boxes. And uh, got each of our Joes for uh, a little, little around $25, so not bad for a comic store pickup. But uh, come on back, we'll take them out of the box and take a closer look at our haul. Just wanted to take a quick look at the uh, back of our G.I. Joe classified series boxes and uh, there was a lot of uh, unhappy comments that uh, the old uh, 
Major Blood was not announced. Uh, we also got the Alley Vipers there in the image that uh, we haven't had an announcement yet. So hopefully both of those will get details on soon. Would be great additions to the Classified series. Uh, let me know in the comments what G.I. Joes are you hoping that uh, Hasbro adds to the Classified series. All right, so number 25 and 26 in our G.I. Joe Classified uh, series, if you're keeping track of the numbers. Uh, Lady J, she uh, comes with quite a bit. So you got the backpack there, knife. Uh, you got the little uh, ends that fit onto the spear. She's got a gun, her hat. Um, so you can kind of switch out the hair piece and you can see that uh, you got a little bit of the hair and everything going on there. Uh, Flint, he is uh, rocking the vest. Uh, definitely a modern look. That head sculpt got a little bit of a scar going on there. Uh, we got the hat sidearm and then uh like the shotgun type weapon let me know in the comments uh what do you think of these two figures are you going to uh scoop them up find them in stores let me know hats on loaded up they are ready for their mission uh yeah definitely digging these figures definitely cool accessories some fun little things you can switch up whether it's uh the hats the weapons kind of have them uh holstered uh you can see with flint he's got a little extra where you can pack away the uh shotgun if you want got the knife in the holster the little like camera working off switch off the uh tops of the spears so yeah, definitely uh, digging these figures. Great additions. Uh, I can remember with the announcement of G.I. Joe, I was like, I'll pick up Snake Eyes. I don't know about the rest of the G.I. Joes, but uh, these are great additions uh, if you're looking for some more classified figures to add to your collection. Uh, come on back and uh, we're going to check out the Marvel Lightbox next. So out of the box, uh, this looks great. Uh, good old Marvel, the red, the kind of white carved out there is uh, pretty, pretty cool. Make sure uh, when you go on the website, I think they have like a mini one or maybe the mini one sold out now. But uh, if you want to see the Star Wars one, go check out my buddy Jetta Patrol. Uh, his video kind of gave me a heads up about uh, the website and everything and uh, inspired me to uh, pick up this Marvel one. But uh, yeah, it just kind of plugs in here. Uh, this set actually came with the uh, plug-in. So you can plug it into a USB uh, computer or port, but it also had an adapter so you could just uh, plug into any kind of electrical and uh, here we go. So we're just gonna push the button and yeah, check that out. It's Marvel. So pretty cool. Uh, looking forward to kind of putting this with uh, some of the display and everything we got going on. Let me know what you think in the comments. It's marvelous. All right, so we hit uh, the lights, give you uh, one more look. Uh, a little difficult to see the red, just the way we got the lighting now, but uh, look at that. That is pretty cool. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. Smash the like button and uh, let's do this. Let's add, yeah, a little Spider-Man for you. Give you just a little idea of how big this light box is. Uh, you can set it down on the table like we got it or easily 
could be uh, mounted to a wall. But uh, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Smash that like button, share, comment. If you haven't already, jump into the Ken Pool Live. We're having a lot of fun here on YouTube. Also over on Instagram at Ken Pool Live. Hopefully you enjoyed the hunt, the haul. And until next time, always be hunting. Have fun collecting.